Hi everybody, I'm Jim with OpenSource.com. I hope you're having a great summer wherever you are. At number five, three open source alternatives to Microsoft Publisher. Jason Baker says you don't need a proprietary tool to design a great layout. Check out his list of open source alternatives to Microsoft Publisher for designing your next print layout. At number four, build your own open source solar panels. Don Watkins talks with the inventors of the Sunzilla project who've made solar panels easier, cleaner, portable, quiet, and completely open source. At number three, four open source tools I used to write a Linux book. Not me, but Steve Avadia spent the last year writing a book to introduce desktop Linux to non-technical users. The title of the book is Learn Linux in a Month of Lunches. In this article, he shares the open source tools he used, plus, a few things like, you know, pens, paper, and post-it notes. At number two, when Linux is the face of kindness. When people are experiencing hardship in their lives, Phil Shapiro tries to lessen their burden using refurbished Linux desktops and laptops. And finally, at number one, top 10 Raspberry Pi add-on boards. Hats are an add-on circuit boards and accessories that add functionality to your Raspberry Pi. Check out these 10 from Ben Nuttall of the Raspberry Pi Foundation. That's it for the top five this week. Thanks so much for joining me, and I'll see you next time.